Invitational. We're inside the Pearson Athletic Center on the campus of Sidwell Friends School in Washington, D.C. You've got a couple of one-two punches, right? You've got Greg Cunningham and Jada going to Arizona, but you've also got two players for the web school going to LSU. And early. And credit Jada Williams for being aggressive and staying strong with the basketball. Pass is a little bit short, though, able to be intercepted and then taken away. That was beautiful by Bree Robinson. Amazing body control. And her squad, they just feel her joy. And five in the bright blue. We talk about a one-two punch. Angelica Velez on that last jumper. Might have liked to see Rima Collins take it to the basket a little bit more on that play with their defense falling down. Yep. Battle of the Bigs is how my partner, Milana Martin Douglas, is advertising this game. Of course, there's that as well. A little square and off. Tatiana Stovall in now for the web school, big time. Uh, player likes coming off the bench and getting it done. Cunningham made sure there was no second effort. Pass. He's doing some good things. Turn around, knew exactly where she <laughs> was. Those hands, and it just makes for a lot of opportunities to turn it over. Teardrop, Cunningham and Del Rosario playing with two fouls, each of them. It's no good. Samea, left hand on a platter. Final possession of the first half. Jada Williams over to Brad Cunningham. <laughs> Either one. That, I mean, that's... <laughs> That's my question then at that point. They have not made a bucket yet in this half. Meanwhile, Bree Robinson. All every time. Yeah, but so that's Brea Cunningham's third foul. I wonder if they look to go into Brea Cunningham rather than shoot another outside jumper. And they do exactly that. You see another great use of that off arm to kind of get the defense out of her space. Back, beautiful dish. Talk about Rima Collins and the toughness with that rebound. Popped away again, it's Cunningham. Not gonna show up anywhere on a stat sheet? No, right? But that long arm, and one. That whole series by Brea Cunningham, outstanding. Velez. Had three fouls, we haven't seen her since midway through the first. Long ball, beautiful by Briari and Cannon. Being out of the game, you've got Del Rosario being guarded by Jet Walton. Let's see if they run a play for her. They do? Strong move. Funny smiles, um, but also she's dominant in the paint, just like Shaq. Yep, and you, you mentioned it. Generation player. There's another bump and again. 35-33 when Brea Cunningham left the game. It's now been a 7-0 run. Make it a 9-0 run. Yeah, she does a nice job of getting in front of Del Rosario. But this is where their strength has been. Perimeter shooting on the outside. Brea Cunningham, a couple of clean blocks. And La Jolla playing fast. Going over there. Keep an eye on the shot clock. It is at six. Shot's got to go up, and it does from Collins, who can't miss. Yeah, Briar Cannon just showing. That's the third three she's hit. She does a fan fourth three she's hit. She does a fantastic job of just getting her feet set, knocking it down, and taking advantage of the defense shifting. Well, that rotation, Brea Cunningham, other team's better player. And then that doesn't get your stars or your main scorers in foul trouble so they can stay on the court longer. Great pass over and a lot of work. Yeah, I think when she actually gets down to the offensive end, the Tories are running pretty good offense. It's the turnovers in the transition between the good defense 
and the offensive opportunity that's killing them. Shot clock's at three. Glass! Either changes shots or block shots. She grabs rebounds. Yeah, and again, it is Del Rosario now, who now playing for UCLA, having a massive impact. I mean, starting playing a load of minutes, leading score. Webb School pushing it in to Del Rosario in the absence of Cunningham. Yeah, they've got to get the ball in her hands, let her make the decisions. Right, I mean, you're down by 14 with two and a half minutes remaining. You've got Rima Collins coming in and getting the rebound. You need to go inside. You got Del Rosario. Yeah, just wanted to get close. Just, just love, all love. No, but I mean, in their, in the people who do the rankings defense, it's hard to watch every single high school in the country. Well, when you know better. Yeah. And so now you know. Final seconds of this game, an absolutely dominating performance by the Webb School. They win by 20 points. Impressive for the Web School. Tell me what you think about their matchup versus uh, Sidwell. Oh, I'm really excited. I think it's going to be two really tough, balanced teams and a really good defensive matchup as well. What does La Jolla need to do better tomorrow? I think they need to keep Brea Cunningham in the game. No fouls. For my partner, Melana Martin Douglas, I'm Ann Marie Anderson. Thank you to our fantastic crew, and thank you for watching the Geico Girls Basketball Invitational.